Yo, what up guys, OPT Channel here, back at it again with a deck profile video. So a lot of people wanted me to show my Magellan list, so here's the Magellan list. I just took it from a Japanese player and did some changes to the deck. But yeah, for our one cost, let me turn it around. For our one cost, we play of course the Hanya Ball. So this card will search like 60% of the deck. Of course we play the ST10 cards, they're not searchable. But this will search your other cards, like the Magellan and the... Hell's Judgment. For the next two, we only play two times Shiki. Shiki is a 2k counter, but also if you trigger this from life, you can threaten lethal. Just attach Dawns and then swing for lethal, if you miss one body. But primarily a 2k counter. And for other two costs, we play four times the Domino. This is just your low cost blocker. It's searchable, so if you need any blockers instead of the Queen, you can just play this, you can search it. Or use it for a 1k counter. Then for our three costs, we play of course the four times little Sadi. Um, in this build, you want to use this 4-2k counter because you don't really have a lot of options for this card to play out with it. So just for the 2k counter, but if you have to go wide against some decks, you can just play out the Rhinosaurus. I know the Mi Minosaurus. I have no idea. It's upside down. Cannot read it. But yeah, this is a good card. It has no counter. That's the only downside. So you might switch it for another counter like the Mini Koala. But this, uh, on the KO, you draw two cards, trash one, so this is just to filter out your hand, because you have a lot of moon counters. So we can put you just here. And then for our ST 10 cards, we play the 4 times Heat. So, it depends, uh, this deck can go first and second, preferably you want to go second, because you can just drop the 5 Cosmo Jellum on 6 Dons, and then hit for 6, or hit for 7, I mean. But yeah, um, if you go first, on your 3 dawn, three dawn turn you play this, and you go to next turn, you go 5 dons, you use the Magellan, you go minus, so you hit 6 and 6, because this gets a 2k boost if you don minus in your turn. Good card, not searchable, uh, one k counter. Then we play of course the 4 times the new law. Uh, this card is insane, because on play, don minus 1, if your opponent has 7 cards or more in their hand, you can just make them discard 2, while you choose 2 random cards that they have to discard. So this will punish people if they have 7 cards or more in their hand, and it's just a block card that you can play. Always ask how many cards they have in hand before you play it, just to be sure. Uh, for our 5 costs, we play the X-Drake. It's just a pure 2k counter, but if you have no other play, you can just play it because it's a 5k body. And the effect sometimes come up, if your opponent has like 2 cards on hand, or if you know what card they have. If they have 1 card, you know what card it is. You can just play this, they trash the cards from their hand, don't minus 1. Then for the next 5 costs, we play a lot of 5 costs, we will of course play Queen. Uh, Queen is still one of the most insane blockers in the entire game. Uh, on play, on minus 1, draw 2, trash 1, 6k body, so you can easily defend 5k attacks and then you can swing with this if you want to. And then of course for our next 5 cost card, we play the five, 4 times Magellan, which we could play 5. But yeah, this card is insane, this is your entire game plan. Uh, this deck doesn't ramp, only uh, you ramp with Thunder Bagua from life, but still, you don't, you don't have any other way to ramp, so you will not go higher than 7, 8 Dons. Because you want to you want to play this, your opponent minuses a Don, you minus a Don, on KO your opponent minuses 2 Dons. But still, this card is insanely good, just play it back to back to back if you can, and just hit for 6, 6, 6, and no one will clear this, because then they have to go minus 2. Then for our 7 costs, and for our last character cards, we play the 4 times Eustace Captain Kit. This card is insane. Uh, yeah, on play, on minus 1, your leader gains 1000 power during the end of your turn. To the end of your start of your next turn, so in your opponent's turn it becomes 6k. So if you play this, uh, on minus 1, your leader becomes 6k, and then of course your leader effect kicks in, a bonus minus, so you can become 7. So you have a 7k swing and then a 6k leader, and if you chain it back to back, you have more and more. So this card is insanely good. Then for the events, we play only 8. Uh, you play 4 times Judgment of Hell. Uh, insane card, you never want to use the trigger, the trigger is bad. Unless it comes up against yellow or something, if you're already uh, behind the curve. But yeah, uh, Dawn minus 1, you choose 2 characters or leader, character or leader, I give it minus 3k. Insane, and you can just search it with your Hanya Ball. And then of course for the last cards, our only ramp in the entire deck is Thunder Bagua. So yeah, you know it, uh, 2 dons counter, if you have uh, 2 or less life, you can ramp up, and the trigger is add 1 don from your deck instead of this active. 
So this is our only ramp. Uh, I don't play the nine cost Kaido because like I said, you want to play the Magellan back to back to back to back. So you don't really go to eight, nine or ten dons with this deck. So you want to just spam this. But yeah, that's it really quick for Magellan. Uh, I will play this at Barcelona. I might switch maybe the Rhinosauruses for some other cards. Depends. I might try to add the nine cost Kaido in here. Maybe use two nine cost Kaidos and then two different random cards may or just switch these out for the four cost king from the other deck but yeah uh, i am really thinking about this it's a nice card maybe put a koala in or one of the other uh jailer beasts but yeah that's it thanks for watching if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it if you want to see more subscribe and that's it peace